My plan was, um, like, Ray and I talk about it all the time, that one of my, like, superpowers is I just love to race. Um, and so, kind of the plan this morning was just get in the middle of the pool tonight and let the rest take care of it. But let it take care of itself. Um, just every day I got some of the best training partners ever. Uh, Max Reese and Jason Yep, they were in the, the B final and they we race every day. So I, I know what it's like to have a race at the end. And um, yeah, it just comes down to the race. I mean, all around, just an incredible day, an incredible, incredible like atmosphere just here in, in Indy and um, kind of setting up for next year. It feels great. Um, and yeah, I haven't, I've been struggling a lot in the 200 meter breaststroke the past couple of years. Um, so to finally kind of break back through and gain that confidence, especially after this morning, to kind of break 210 again was like, it kind of set me up to know that something special was coming tonight and I just needed to kind of dive in and get it done. I know Ray Luz is famous for our, like IU is famous for our breaststroke practices where we, we train like over distance like crazy. Um, and so I, I feel confident that I can uh, like keep I have a very high tempo, but I feel very confident with the way we train that I, I can keep that high tempo, and especially like when push comes to shove, I know I can just keep relying on my tempo to keep me going. I don't know about wisdom, but I'm kind of convinced that uh, Lily King won the women's in lane five, and then Jason Yep won the B final in lane five, and I just happened to be in lane five. And when I saw Jason kind of just close on that last 50, I was like, there's something magical about lane five. I was like, this is happening for IU. Um, and so, yeah, I don't know about wisdom, but I, I kind of am convinced lane five was IU's lucky lane tonight. <laughs>